wake up on Nagi to a top morning. But there's a change in the weather on the way. We pack up camp. We will backtrack over to Moa Island to top off the fuel as we have a fair bit of open ocean to get across. In heavy seas, we will use more fuel. And it's always good to have that safety margin, just in case. As we head out, the conditions are worsening by the minute. We arrive in at St Paul's on Moa Island and it's pretty quiet. Just the wild horses greet us down at the beach. We then discover the fuel station is a fair way inland. This will be fun. You drive the boat up here? And down I the street? Think could. Yeah? That looks like the survey down there, mate. Didn't work. Didn't work. <laughs> oh. Stop. That looks like us, mate. That store there. Now all we got to do is get the fuel from there to the boat. Hundred bucks says I haven't got any Gary cans. <laughs> You're on, mate. I bet you I get a Mars bar, though. <laughs> Hello. How you going? What's the pump number? Hey, what's the pump number? One. There's only one pump. <laughs> <laughs> so we had a quick check to the locals and they're telling us that the uh, that strong wind warning, if you're going to try and cross over to uh, side by from here, it's just going to get messy, absolutely messy. You can get in behind the backs of the reefs, but then there's still that open patch of run and uh, they're telling, they're looking at us like you're crazy. So I think we might have to rethink the plan and uh, we'll get a bit of fuel in the boat at the moment. Rethink the plan, I don't think it's gonna come off. Here, mate, grab these. The strong wind warning has come early and the locals say the open water run to Saibai Island will become very dangerous once we leave the protection of the reefs. With 25 to 30 knots forecast, we'll have to err on the side of caution. And as the skipper, I'm gonna to have to make the call not to head to Saibai Island. Done. It will become just too dangerous. We need a couple more drums yet, but we gotta be careful with this reef because if we get stuck here, we're gonna be stuck here for another 24 hours. So. One more drum to go in, and we should be able to get the hell out of here. The tide's dropping fast. 